Hi, I'm Rich Pomerantz. I'm a professional freelance photographer, and I'm also an instructor here at the New York Botanical Garden. Like you, I love to make photographs. The New York Botanical Garden is a premier destination for finding all kinds of landscapes, gardens, and flowers to create images of, to try out new techniques, and to hone your photographic skills. I want to help you to become a better garden photographer. So we have created this series of video tutorials where I'm going to give you some tips to help you improve your photography. And for most of these tips, you will not need any special or fancy equipment. Here we are in the historic Enid A. Hopped Conservatory at the Botanical Garden. Are you ready? Let's get started. We tend to like pictures that have certain compositional elements. One of my favorite compositional tools is called leading lines. Basically, I create the image with lines leading into the frame from one of the corners instead of having the lines just jump into the picture from anywhere along the edge. By leading the viewer's eye in from the corner, you create a more dynamic photograph and you help the viewer find their way into the picture. Using curves is another great way to lead the eye in and around the image. Notice also how close I get to the subject, even without using a macro lens. By eliminating extraneous elements, the photo becomes only about the thing that I want to include in the image. For some really dramatic images, you can combine this with another technique called the rule of thirds. Check out my video on the rule of thirds for more information about that. So thanks for joining me today. I hope this quick tip will help you capture some great images. To see more of my work and see what I'm working on, please visit me online at richpomerance.com. And for more information on photography at the garden, visit nybg.org. <laughs>